Jabir ibn Hayyan, also known as Jabir ibn Hayyan, was an Arab scientist known by the title Father of Chemistry. He was born in Kufa, Iraq, in the 8th century AD and received his education in the fields of medicine, chemistry, and pharmacy. His father was from Yemen and worked in trade, while his mother was from Kufa. Jabir grew up in a scholarly and cultural environment, as his father had an interest in sciences and literature and encouraged him to read and learn. Jabir also frequented the library in Kufa, where he had access to various books and references. Jabir ibn Hayyan began his professional life as a physician, but quickly became fascinated with chemistry. He was captivated by the study of materials and their reactions and started conducting his own experiments in his laboratory. His interest in chemistry started at an early age as he read books and references related to the field. He conducted chemical experiments at his home and benefited from the experiences of other chemists of that time. Jabir's experiments were groundbreaking in the field of chemistry. He performed numerous new experiments and developed many new techniques. He also invented various chemical apparatus, such as the alembic. Jabir ibn Hayyan was also a pioneer in the field of analytical chemistry. He developed various methods of material analysis, including methods of weighing, composition analysis, and electrical analysis. In the year 766 AD, he met the minister Jafar al-Barmaki, who was one of the greatest intellectuals of the Abbasid era. Jafar al-Barmaki was impressed by Jabir ibn Hayyan's intelligence and scientific abilities and provided him with financial and moral support. Jabir ibn Hayyan achieved many accomplishments in the field of chemistry. One of the most notable was being the first person to practically apply chemistry in history. He discovered nitric acid and sulfuric acid for the first time. He prepared aqua regia for the first time. He was the first to create inflammable paper and made the first heat-resistant glass. He also created the first soap. Additionally, Jabir ibn Hayyan was interested in studying metals and alloys. He conducted numerous experiments on metals, developed many methods of smelting and processing them. He was also interested in studying essential oils and medicinal preparations and invented various medicines and medical treatments. Jabir ibn Hayyan left behind a rich scientific legacy. He wrote over 200 books in the field of chemistry and other sciences, and his works were translated into numerous languages, influencing scientists worldwide. He passed away in Damascus, Syria, in the year 816 A.D.